actually going to be doing another um everything five pounds haul which is literally crazy because i only done my first one two weeks ago like exactly two weeks ago today and they have already very 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 kindly gifted me another huge box of things like i don't even think i'll be reading this all of this all over again so i'm literally blown away that they've even done that so last time i made a youtube video about it and a styling video on my instagram and i had to send them over some photos and i posted my own photos too so they must have been happy with whatever i done because they've kindly asked me to work with them again all different than the last time last time i kind of went for dresses and stuff and this time i went for completely different and less shoes so i'm actually going to do an unboxing and try on so there will be clips of me actually wearing the things because everyone was asking for that on my instagram the last time so that's what i'm gonna do trying to get into these boxes is literally a workout okay so this is going to be like a complete first impressions because obviously i've literally just opened it as for last time i had already gone through the stuff and they haven't asked me to do this video so all opinions are completely my own i'm just going to take things out as they're in the box i'm not going to do it in any type of order i added this one to the basket at the very end last time because i had like 250 left to spend out of a hundred pound budget also i I said at the start of my last video, like if if anyone doesn't know, Everything Five Pounds is like a wholesaler kind of um website, and they buy their stuff in from all different brands like Topshop, Misguided, Pretty Little Thing, Marks and Spencers, all different shops. Excuse the train going past my house. They buy stuff off other brands instead of it going to landfill and sell it for a cheaper price. So that um kind of answers people's question on if it's good quality or if the sizing is um, right basically it depends on the brand but every single thing that I got last time was perfect and all the shoe sizes and clothes sizes I get between an extra small six or an eight sometimes even a small if it's like an oversized thing so in my well in my defense in my experience it's all been very good so I went into like the 250 um section of it and the sale and I got this little dress. I think this is the cutest thing ever. It's just like a little yellow floral dress with the buttons down the front. I will insert a clip of me wearing it and I would style it with either like long boots or slip up boots. I just think that is so cute and it actually looks like it was, I think that is the Topshop label. If you can see they've cut it out but I think that's the Topshop label. That would have been like a good 30 or 40 pound and it is literally five pounds well 250 250 if you get it in the sale anything that's still available um i will link below i've quickly styled this how i would wear it you can like see from here okay i love this it was originally from topshop as i said and i just said it with like a fedora hat and some chunky black boots i actually would probably wear the boots that are up to here but trying to get them on is an absolute workout and i can't be bothered doing that so yeah this is what it looks so like. hopefully some of this stuff will still be here because i've placed an order on friday or saturday so not long ago at all so hopefully there'll still be stuff this here. little dress is quite similar in a way it's a similar kind of style um i've gone very girly in this but it's just it's easy to throw on with boots. I got this dress. It's like a square neck, which I said in my last video I love. And this is not going to be everyone's taste, by the way, but I like it. You'll see the way I'll style it whenever I put it up. But it's short sleeves, so the sleeves cuff in, and then it's like a little slip dress. There was all different um colors as well in this one. It was from Yar. Year Yar whatever this brand is again i've done like the same with this one this one is so cute too like i love them both so much 
it's such good quality and again with just like chunky black boots i love it so much this one is like satin it's so nice it's just so nicely made i actually like this more than i thought i was going to really <laughs> meowing to get at the door <laughs> um, this is from the same place actually there's quite a lot of labels in there that have that um brand so clearly i went for the type of stuff that they sell it's just a white button up shirt but it's like a satiny material i bought this because i always see um miss Jocelyn on instagram with like a really baggy oversized shirt over like underwear or over like a bikini so i picked this up for that kind of purpose i got this in a size small because i wanted it oversized anyway but it said on the website okay, so as i said um I got this for the purpose of like over underwear or over um, a bikini. This is like ideal for what I wanted, but it's just really not ideal to show you on the camera because I'll get um, removed or something. It is very sheer. It's like a satiny, I think you can probably see it in the light there actually. It's like a satiny, shiny kind of material, but yeah, I do really like it. I just um, do want to get a boobs out on the camera. Trousers are from the same brand they must i don't know if this is maybe a new brand that they've started working with because i don't I, like in my last video i got nothing from this brand and this video i have like five things but i just think these are sick this is actually like i think these were the very first thing i put in my basket so i got these in an eight and they are these white cargo trousers or cargo pants with little chain detail on at the side and the pocket details at either side too they would be so expensive to buy like instagram sites and stuff sell stuff like that for festivals and all like i just think they are so cool they're actually i expected these to come and me not really to like them that much or they'd be too low waisted or something but they look literally perfect like perfect so hopefully they are nice on okay so i've just thrown the white trousers on with what i was already wearing and they are perfect like perfect i love them so 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 much like they couldn't be a better fit they're fully high-waisted like way above the belly button like they are perfect i love them i love them so much and they're cuffed around the ankle too like they are literally the perfect fit i am so happy with them like i literally wasn't even gonna get them and I was like, maybe they'll just be like rubbish quality or something. They are perfect. I love this them. little top is from the exact same place as the last ones. Yar. I don't know if maybe um, if you look up that on the site, would it come up? I don't think so. I think they try and like not tell you what um, each brand is from. But in every other thing that has a label on it they cut it off but in these they've kept like the actual tags and stuff on so maybe it's like a partner brand and it's not like a resale i'm not too sure tie-dye shirt i believe on the website it's called a blazer but it is like a little cropped shirt and they had this in like all different styles all different colors they had like a pink yellow green red i think and this one but I just thought this one would go with slightly more. I'm hoping this is nice on. This is one of them things that I'm like, this. No, it it will it'll look cool. I I think it'll look cool. Again, I'm just like, why am I out of breath? Like, why am I out of breath? I'm just like throwing this on with um stuff that I kind of had, um sunglasses and the hat. But I really like this. Again, it's just like a little blazer shirt kind of thing with one button. But I've just got like a little bralette underneath it and i've just thrown on some like baggy black shorts and boots yeah no i actually really really like this more than i thought i was going to again i just think it's like good what else to say about it i think it's cool i seen this and was like there's no way that that's only gonna be a fiver because imagine this was in a shop right so this is from this still has the like label I don't really know what's going on because last time they cut all the labels off and like cut out the tags and stuff but this one is kept on as well as the other ones so there must be new brands that they've started working with because this is like a chinese brand 
and it actually has their original price on it if you can see but i don't really know what that would be in um pounds i'm gonna look it up and i'll insert it somewhere here of how much pounds this would be the trench coat like how how is i just don't understand how this was five pounds like i'm gonna keep saying that but like five pound i would spend more on a chinese this trench coat and it is so good such good quality it has little like shoulder pads but not drastically and then it's not too 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 long it's like just below kind of hip length i just i just love this website so so much like so much and everyone's like oh, but is the quality good or oh but yeah like five pound i'm really happy with that that was one of the things that i was kind of like that'll come and it'll be like a flimsy like jacket or something but it's not so i've just put this coat with um leather leggings and a pair of like matching sunglasses this is like not really um my style of coat like i've got a trench coat but it's like floor length and it's leather so it's like slightly more girly like real girly coat but i still really like it like i still actually do really really like it i think it's just good like it's very um light like it's very lightweight so i think it's just be good for throwing on like coming up to the summer and even in the summer because i live in belfast and um the weather is shit so you always need a coat anyway it needs a bit of an iron but it's so well made and stuff like i really do like it. really really well made actually yeah no it's not really um my style but i do still really like it. this was originally from new look and i got it in a 10. I don't think it had an 8 left. I think it had a 10 to 12 left, but I wanted it to be oversized. It is this suede camo shirt. I love this, like it's perfect. It's just what I wanted. I absolutely love this. I actually think this is just gonna be what I'm wearing today. I love this. It's only from New Look, so it probably was about 25 pound-ish. I love it so much. If I was wearing this, I would wear it open, so I'd probably take, um, just take the belt off. Or you could always just um, wear it more like jacket style. This one is going to get wore to death. I knew I would love this as soon as it came. It's just the colour, I just love it. It's like with tan and black. And it is so, it's literally such good quality. I love, I love, 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 love love this one every instagram person seems to have one of these but i didn't so it is this long sleeve little button up what do you call them though it's like a clasp i'm sure you've all seen these before it's just like an off the neck thing but i just didn't have one so i needed more dressy tops especially for whenever lockdown is finally over and we can start going on date nights because that is what i'm most looking forward to it. I just feel like it's so like normal now everyone has one of these but I didn't and I can't believe that was only five pounds got it um with leather leggings at the minute this isn't actually what I would wear it with but I love it I love the neckline and I love the little um gold buckle detail and I just threw it over my head because I um wouldn't be bothered doing all that but I've got makeup on it does that happen to everyone else like to try one thing on and there's mitten i seen this on the site and I love, love gothic print, like the gothic like font. Like it's in my Instagram name and everything, like I just, I don't know, I'm so drawn to it. I have like jewellery and stuff that's, yeah, <laughs> I have jewellery and stuff that's that print. I don't know if that's gonna focus. It says bossy. So I seen this and it had that font and I was like, oh my god, I'm getting it. And then I was like, what does it say? So I had to ask my instagram story what did it say but i found out it's this i believe on the website it was called like a shacket like a shirt jacket, jacket. and it's i again i would wear this this has a label on it too we're getting very up market since two weeks ago everything has like an actual hard label on it so i would wear this open again um and it says i feel like on this bit and at the back it says I feel like Kylie 
but I couldn't read the Kylie bit. I was like, what does that say? And my mum was like, I think it's Kylie. And I was like, Kylie who? I was just thinking like, like Kylie Minogue. Shows how out of sync I am. Obviously it's Kylie Jenner. I think it's like a copy of, I feel like Kanye or whatever. I feel like, I don't know, whatever one Kanye West came out of, came out with. So it's just this jacket, but I love it. Throwing this one on with um, like a big pair of sunglasses. It's just how I would like style this kind of bag. But again, I've just got it on with leather leggings. I love it. I really actually really, really do like this one. And that's just the back of it. Like stuff like this is so dear, like so expensive. Like I just don't know and the quality of it is really really good. It's just easy to throw on over something like simple and it just looks like you've actually made a bit of an effort when you have it. I'm so impressed this time, like so impressed, like more so than last time. This time to be fair I went for slightly more casual clothes because last time I went for all dresses and stuff. Which was great, but this time I was like, well, I'm not gonna do the same again or it's a bit boring. This was, I believe, the last one on the site. And as soon as I got it in my basket, I was like running to the checkout because once it is gone, like that is it, it's gone unless someone returns something, which I don't think anyone really does that because it's fiber. But they keep releasing different ones of these like every so often. There was a girl on the everything five pounds thing that had one with an american flag and it said like a date like 1994 or something on it tried to find that it was gone and then i seen this one so it's like a pullover zip up top and it was from daisy street follow us on instagram i'll go and have a look at their instagram i got it in a six i think this was the last one to be honest or there might have been this one and like a different size but it's just this pullover and it has little mountains. I just think it is so cute. I'll probably wear it slightly open so that I don't get um, makeup all over the collar. I actually like this one more than the American flag one so it worked out well for me. But they keep kind of releasing like a different version of this. So if you're looking for this and it's not there, I'll link one below that maybe is similar or type in pullover. Because that's what I did. It's a bit see through, but it's very like it's very light. But I think that is actually quite good to have, like thrift store vibes. But I actually really like it. I think it's just a bit quirky and cute. Um, I just put it on with leather leggings. But I don't know. I would probably um keep this down because I get makeup on literally everything. I really like this little this little thing. I'm a sucker for little like mountains and stuff I think they're very cute so happy with the stuff so far like I actually really am I actually put this in my basket thinking oh no I'll find something else that I like more but then the more I thought about it the more I was like no I like that it's bad that I'm getting out of breath just speaking like that's the struggle we're all coming to now like I'm out of breath from talking <sighs> pink shirt it's like a really light like this weighs nothing a really 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 lightweight pink blouse again or pink shirt i would probably wear this open with leather leggings but for the try on here i will um just probably wear clothes again though this is um an instagram site called wednesday's girl so i'll have to have a look at that too this one isn't um it's not very me like it, it is like um it's a crop bit which I like and the material is like a suede which I like but it's like fits a bit more like a work shirt than I thought it was going to you know like I don't know maybe it's just me ignore the train it needs to be just a bit more like casual casually dressed I think um I don't know I don't know tell me if I don't know tell me your thoughts next up I actually got this from the men's section i briefly looked through the men's because the men's is literally only like a couple of pages long so it doesn't take too long but i got this in a small because it was the smallest size there was um i would have got it in oh my god this was 55 pounds and 90p so euros is at the top and pounds is at the bottom 
So it's by a brand called Sixth June. I'm gonna have to look that up and I am baffled. I'm glad I bought this even if even if I'm not gonna wear it, I'll give it to someone. Oh my goodness, that is unreal. Anyway, I should probably show you what it is. It's um a pink, I don't know what colour that is, salmon pink, light pink, I don't actually know. It's just a hoodie, but it has all these like um cutouts in the sleeves and like distress detail in here. It's also so thick, like so thick. I hope this does um look okay on me. If not, one of my good friends, probably a friend that's a boy, <laughs> will benefit from this because what the hell? 50, what did I say? <laughs> £55.90 My god, I'm glad I picked that up even if I don't wear it Bargain <laughs> Okay, so I knew this one was going to be like a little bit big Because it's um, a men's small rather than a female small So it is like really oversized and stuff But this is the way I kind of um, would wear a lot of my hoodies anyway and I love, like I still love it. Like I love the detailing of it in the sleeves, um, and the back of it. I just think it's so cool. If if I keep it for a while and I don't really wear it that much, um, I'll give it to someone. But it's roasting. Like I've put it on for like two seconds. It's so thick and it's fleecy inside. Like it's fully um, like that fleecy material inside of it. So I think I will um get good, good use of it like just to chill around the house i can't believe how much it was actually originally priced at that is insane but it is like one of them kind of boys jumpers it's like sex silk and like stuff like that so it, that's why it was dear this one's like a little um again label still attached am i making up that the last ones didn't have labels the last ones had labels right but they were like, let me explain. Okay, so the last ones had labels like this one, but it was everything five pounds own label. So it's plain at the back with a barcode and that is it. Like that was all the, all the stuff that I got two weeks ago. They all had the plain label, right? Now this week, they all have the original brands labels like don't get it don't really get it it's like a little cute um white cardigan with like the lace detailing around the front and it's like i actually thought it was a bit more cropped but it's actually quite full length well if i don't like it i'll definitely give it to my granny because it's like a little granny cardigan but i think it'll be really cute especially with like a tan and stuff we'll see in the next clip if i do like it. honestly I think it is the cutest thing ever i love the neckline of it i think it's so girly and cute and just like flattering oh i love it and i've just again got this with like black leather leggings but i just think that is so cute i actually really love this i think it's adorable it's really really well made and well finished too and this is like a little cardigan a bit like a granny cardigan so my nanny could benefit from this one if I don't like it, but I no, I do. I love it. <laughs> Sorry, nanny. Um, I love this. It's like an oversized granny cardigan, so it's like a big wide neck, and then it just has one button to secure it. But I just think stuff like this is perfect again for like throwing on because I always wear matching tracksuits, but. I just love stuff like that to just throw on easily in the house instead of a dressing gown because it makes you like look a bit more done up than a dressing gown. I love... <coughs> no joke, I actually think I might be getting coronavirus, like I'm not even joking. <coughs> anyway, I love this cardigan, love it so much, like so, so much. Although it is just literally like a plain um, granny cardigan. But I really, really like it. Really like it. And it's like one of them things you could just like I've paired it with um like a heel boot. Like you could easily just go out for dinner like this and it looks like you've made some sort of an effort even though you're just um the comfort queen. But it's like all these little um zigzags on it. 
I really like this, you know. I might even wear this today. I really like this. It's so cozy. Yeah. I said in my last video that um, I loved the brown. Um, why am I out of breath? I hope I don't have coronavirus. Um, I said in my last video that I loved the brown leopard print trousers so much that I wish I got the other colour, so I got the other colour. <laughs> the last ones I got were brown and these ones are mustard. There is minimal difference. So again, I got these in a the small. Um, they were a bit big the last time, but as soon as I put a belt on with them, then they're perfect. Um, so yeah, there are these. They look, I know that they look plastic like they look as if they're like leather and really hard but like they're not like they're really 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 soft so yeah they're just like a wide leg um leopard print trouser i love them i actually might even prefer these than the other ones <laughs> but i just love them so much that i had to pick them up in the other color these on with what i was um wearing anyway so they're just high waisted and like flared at the bottom i love 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 these so much i might even like them more than the brown pair maybe it's just because i've looked at the brown pair for like two weeks now but i really really love them carol baskin <laughs> so i have two more clothing items and four shoes left so again this was um i had a hundred pound budget again and the shipping was i don't know i actually don't know at all i picked the dear shipping <laughs> because i wanted it here quicker but they very kindly paid for it anyway so i think the shipping was going to be 20 pound um but yeah they paid for it very 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 kindly this is um much thicker than i thought it was i thought it was going to be like the suede brown flimsy shirt it actually seems to be more of like a coat. Um, yeah, I, I don't know what brand that is, sorry. It's Denim Stories. Never heard of it. But it's more like a jacket. I am talking shit. It's a jumpsuit. Where did I even pull that from? Where did I... Oh. I, I was going to order a different thing and it was this, but it was brown, but it was a jacket. Okay. <sighs> Scrap all that. It's a jumpsuit. <laughs> Board suede kind of um, jumpsuit, full length jumpsuit. You will see this better <laughs> in the try on clip. I was literally just talking the biggest load of the there. So yeah, it is. That's such good quality actually. It's like a boiler shirt. I hope that fits because that's well known. It actually fits me really, really well. I quite like it just like off the shoulder instead of the whole way up, but obviously wear it whatever way you want. But I just paired it with like some little crocodile um, heel boots. I love it. I really, really like it. I really like it. I do prefer it um, just kind of off the shoulder than like, it just goes like this. But I quite like it when it's like slightly more relaxed looking. I'm so impressed so far. This next one is, um, I seen it on someone's, I don't know, she was so funny. Like she was so funny, this girl that I watched. I'm actually gonna try and find her video and I'll, I'll link it below because she was, I don't know, she was just hilarious. I subscribed to her straight away. She was so funny. But she got this like pajama set and it looked sick on her and she was like this is my favorite thing of the whole haul <laughs> so i just got it it's just a plain um purple maroon top with matching like boxer kind of shorts for the head that they're so cute they do look a bit big If they fit, you will see them in the try-on clip. If not, they were too big. <laughs> that was all 
the clothes that I got and then I got four pairs of shoes Ooh. I hope these are nice I forgot I got these I'm actually buzzing but I'm surprised they're in a box this small because why are these in a box this big <laughs> these are so cool <laughs> I don't know if these are gonna look nice on or not but if they don't it's more for the gram it's more for an instagram so <laughs> open toed lace up thigh high boot for a fiver for five bloody pound winner 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 chicken dinner if these fit these will probably be my favorite purchase if they look nice I don't think they look tacky they do it's always one the last ones was the green boots and I said they're tacky but I like them these ones slightly tacky but I like them so everyone's been wearing them Ugg slippers on Instagram and I am not willing to pay £100 for a pair of slippers I always wear sliders in the house I can wear them my guest sliders now but they're just not as cosy as slippers so I just felt like I needed a new pair of slippers and I got these I just think they're cute around the house not much to say about them really but i got some leopard print slippers right these are a love or hate these are a love or hate moment situation you'll i don't know i personally like them i actually hated them for ages whenever people were wearing them i was like why are they wearing jesus sandals like they look like moses sandals jesus sandals things that your granddad would wear with a pair of socks but Instagram is making um, ugly stuff cool and these are one of the things that I think are an ugly thing but they're cool just grand the sandals with the two straps here and this goes around the back of your foot and the strap here I just think they're cool I literally just think they're cool like I might try them on and be like, Emily, what the fuck did you just do? But <laughs> I think they're cool. And I've seen like cool people wearing them and they make them look cool. So I mean, hopefully I can make them look cool. Probably not. But. So last pair of shoes I actually had in my basket the last time. And then I just liked something else more and I had to get rid of something. So I got rid of these and then I seen them. They were still there. So I was like, right. It's fate, they're still here. And there was loads and loads and loads of different colors of these heels with the buckle detail. Like, I just think they're really cute. They'll just like jazz up a plain black um, outfit. That's literally it. Like they have the velcro around the back and then these around the front. Like, I'm not really a big heel kind of girl. So when I do wear heels, I prefer them to be like funky rather than just like really really girly and the heel looks good on them like it's a thick one so I don't think um it's gonna be as painful I don't know it, it honestly it might be but here's hoping I'm glad I got them now very glad I nearly got the black ones and then I was like Emily right you need to um steer away from black so I lose everything this time I will try and um cut it a bit more and put in the clips of me wearing stuff i am delighted absolutely delighted you will have seen if anything doesn't fit or isn't the way i thought it was in the try on clips but so far i actually am way happier with this um haul than i was with the one two weeks ago i loved all my stuff two weeks ago loved it but this is just like another level like it's stepped it up again like i'm so so grateful that this company wants to continually um work with me because it's literally overwhelming like i'm so 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 happy and grateful so if you've got to the end thank you so much um i've been loving seeing everyone's purchases like i love it so if you do buy anything from the site or you need help with anything let me know and put it in your story and tag me or something if you do make an order because i literally love seeing what everyone else has bought like it's i love it so much um so yeah thank you so much for watching and see you later bye <laughs>